One logistics nightmare later. What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again here with Soundhead Entertainment, and we are finally here in NASCAR Heat 5 and ready to begin our custom championship season with no playoffs, as you saw there. I'll have a bunch of the settings and different things getting set up in the background for you to watch, but we've got a season-long points format, old-school style. We'll be using our custom car this season, and I'm sure we'll redesign it plenty of times between now and the end of the season. But before we get too deep into that, we must dive into this because feast your eyes on the goodies that have been sent to us from the fine and glorious folks at Fanatic, ladies and gentlemen. They sent us the entire sim rig, the pedals with the load cell brake kit, the wheel base, the wheel hub, the NASCAR rim, and the shifter. These are legends we're talking about here, people. Absolute legends. So as we confirm our settings, we need to extend a huge thank you to the people at Fanatic because that is just an incredible gesture. And now we have no excuse to not take that equipment and take it to all of these drivers and show them what's good. Show them who's the best driver out on the track and why it's us. And if we're gonna prove it, we gotta prove it right off the bat at Daytona. At night. Let's go racing boys. Well, 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 this will be a very interesting race indeed. We've got stories of the race here. Ross Chastain looks well prepared. Ryan Newman struggling. Alex Bowen failed pre-race inspection. But I think the biggest story of the race is us making our, essentially our debut with the wheel and pedals. I think we've only ever done it twice before in like the iRacing videos that we did. Stay so sharp. it's been a while and it's a brand new rig. So let's get to it. Green flag is out. And we have got to come from the back to the front. And I've got my boy Keselowski back here with me too. Hell Something there. bad must have happened to him. Hopefully, uh, maybe we can work together to get to the front there. Be rad. Wouldn't be too bad of an idea, I don't think. So, I need to worry mostly about just keeping it nice and smooth. Don't want to crash. Can't imagine Careful. that being Still very there. fun with force feedback involved. So, definitely don't want to be doing that. Want to just keep things nice and smooth. And as I say that, we Hold go three line. wide. Down the back stretch. Give me that Starcom suck, please. Who? And let me all oh, just sneak through the hole there beautifully into the gap to get down to the bottom for the corner. And then there's a massive checkup on the Careful, bottom. Still there. So I give a little mini Our pack outside. to Reagan. I get a mini pack of my own from the 49 and then give one to the double zero as we're all just pushing and shoving back here. And double zero's protecting that bottom lane pretty still good there. too. I looked down there and he was like, don't you even dare think of this. Well, let's see if we can make some positions of one Still lap there. and we gained one spot essentially barely got a second one here as we're gonna get by Suarez the outside gets held up Our and so does the outside. inside and then I put it outside. on the apron tried to make too big of a Are move there the right, I gotta get used to the amount of uh, like input that I need to give outside. because that was far too much and I'm gonna go all the way to the back here I'm losing all my positions here if we can get this suck pull out and pull in line with Timmy Hill down on the bottom here. Careful, still there. All clear. Not bad, not a bad pass right there. All right, making our way back up here. Nice little shot to Timmy Hill. Oh, it was into the side of William Byron. Timmy Hill's deciding whether or not he wants to crash. Decides not to. If I could just go ahead and clear you, Timmy, that'd be great. Oh, here comes the end with that push. Give me that push. Thank you very much. Give me that side draft off of Truex a little bit. Can I finally get by the double zero, please? No. He cuts me off the guy. He's like serving it. He like swerved and celebrated it. What a piece of work Still this there. guy is. And I like Starcom. I want to say Got mean things to you, quit hoop, but I'm not going to do it. I could roast every inch of you for that Texas pit road right entry. Clear. Oh, I could be here for days. But I'm not going to do it. I'm going to be the bigger man. We got by him. Now we got to get by Matt the Benedetto and Brees. Greece is looking to be alive. There's smoke up in front of us. Super up. Off. Off I think somebody may have naded it. And the green flag flies once again here. We are back underway. Let me get away from this double zero real quick. Careful, still there. Oh, here we come. We got to make a move somewhere. One it's going to stall out up to the high side. Sorry, Priest. I kind of just knocked the hell right out side. of you for no good You're reason. Right. I tend to do that a lot. You'll learn. It's a long season, 30 races. 29 more. Jesus, is this a push from the 80s? He's pushing me almost too hard. He's trying to make me go four wide over here. I bounce off the bottom lane. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have the control you guys do. I got to get used to it. 
left side. All these guys are like, get this maniac out of here. They're talking the same way about me as I was Quinn a moment ago. They're really not gonna like this. I don't even know if I'm gonna like this. I can't even hold a wheel on the bottom. Why am I trying to do it on the top side? This is good. Oh, there it is. There it is. No, I'm sorry, please. Ah! Clear left. Jeez, how are we gonna get away with that one? I love the bottom line. Life is just so much easier and more calm on the bottom line. Oh, you're not hitting the apron. But I'd rather hit the apron than the wall any day. And new rule, no more outside three wide excursions. That did not end well for us. Hopefully this big old push from Chastain will though. He's given us that well-prepared push. One of the stories of the race and I'm handing it off to Haley and he's doing absolutely nothing with it. So I'm gonna take a peek. Oh man, talk about jamming the door open with a crowbar. Stay low, stay low. Still there. Oh, they're getting antsy up top and there they go. They're backing out. They were Far four outside. wide. Matt Kenseth and Kurt Busch backing out of that one. A couple right, of elder statesmen said no thank you to that one. And that throws us in the top 10. I barely even noticed. Now we've got oh, some room right. to work with. We're just kind of quietly climbing our way up the ladder. And now we got moves to be made through the middle here. Oh, can I get clear of the double zero? Just barely. He keeps his headlight out on me. Oh, and then I do a little slap with Logano. Getting a slight push from Corey LaJoy. Oh, and we're going to get the big suck from Hamlin now. The top three line it up perfectly for me. We got to take it inside. And Brennan Gaunt's going to come down. We'll give him a shot into the corner. Give him the push. You got to be careful doing that, though. He goes straight up the hill. And I almost go across the nose of old Dennis Hamlin. Oh, here comes another shot from the double zero, though. That's slightly concerning. We've got Texas winner AD up here. Oh, Brennan God leaves the door open. You fool. I shall take advantage immediately. Thank you Still for there. the assist. And now I got the double zero. I need him to give me a shot or something. These guys are hanging kind of tough on the outside. I need one more push, and here it comes. Oh, it's going to be a monster push, and we're going to get clear Nobody easily. Clear right. Going to get up and block that lane a little bit and come right back down to the bottom. We are commanding this one. Oh, we might not be in the lead for long, though. Here comes the charge back. And they even got me at the line. All right, clear low. You jerks didn't even let me lead the lap, and it's going to be a twofer if I can't keep LaJoy behind me as well, and it is. Hamlin had gone, sneak back by me, and I'm getting almost too much of a push from the double zero. He's pushed me out of the bottom lane. Oh, I got a little run on Hamlin coming here. Can I do something with Still it? There. Oh, I might just barely have a headlight there, and I do. Maybe I just had him psyched out mentally. I have this AI in shambles right now. That's Still right. There. Get up the track. Give me a push. Clear. Do something useful. I got two cars coming from behind. Somebody better give me a push. There we go. Looking give me it all. Now. This is taking packing to a bit of an extreme. Doesn't help when I'm putting the car on the apron, though. And Gacy still pushed me up into the wall. No. Hold on to it. Oh, and the caution's out. Man, we just got torn the hell up. Well, absolute scenes here at Daytona International Speedway as we head back to green. Hard to blame Joey Gates for that last incident because I did hit the apron and launch us out of the bottom groove when all he was doing was trying to push, but he did pull up Brad Keselowski and just decide not to lift. So make of that Left what you will. We're gonna barely clear Timmy Hill here and we're in the suck. Oh, here we go. Timmy That's Hill, Timmy Hill with a God tier push. Look at this. And then I put it on the apron to completely negate all of it like a true bum. But we are in that pull still. So let's go. I see Blaney's rear bumper. We've been buying Blaney a good bit this race, it feels like. Could we get back Careful, to him and maybe buy him? We're gonna have to deal with his teammate first. And it looks like we just Got might here, but now. they're deciding to drag with each other and not us. Finally, they give us a little bit of room. Joey's gonna be in the sucker hole all the way to the back. See you later, pal. 
We'll use a little bit of this Careful, banking to grab there. some speed off the corner. Maybe get to the inside of Blaney and shove him up a little bit. Oh, he's doing the shakes. Careful, still there. He's got the Arm shivers. The we don't want to be dealing with that. Outside. Blaney, you and I have done enough today. Oh, please don't. I'll just let you have it back. Oh, there we go. Blaney got it out of shape. He's still getting it out of shape. And he'll go in the sucker hole as well. And it looks like he's still free wide back there. So not catching any breaks. Got recent winner Custer here, rookie. A rookie winner. Oh, and the caution is out. Sorry, Cole Custer, your 15 minutes of fame will have to wait. The caution's out again. And under way we go. And oh, I got a bad restart. Oh, the restart gear wasn't in enough. Or more accurately, I didn't quite get the shift in time. Helps if you get through the gears, you big dummy Ed. Oh, everything's gonna be fine. I've got the legend Bobby Carter on my rear bumper now. Oh, we're good. There's nothing to worry about. We'll probably push to the lead. We might lap every. Oh my God, Newman. Okay, I just want a little bit of that draft from up ahead. You didn't need to do that. In fact, the less Ryan Newman based accidents we have here at Daytona, given the year, is probably for the better, Ryan. If you could just chill. Oh, and I think the audio's bugged. Yep. All clear. Yeah, if you're wondering why it sounds like we're about to be abducted, just don't worry about it. Oh, come on. Can I get to that bottom before they get down? Yes, they left it open. Yeah, Wide yeah. open for my massive run to run right through. Come on, we might get back to the top 10 with Careful, this. If we can move there. it right, we're going to just give a push to Timmy Hill and make it to the middle. I kind of did both. I literally did I both. All right, well, I guess I'll just go back to the wow. bottom. We got to make a move here, Timmy. Either you go or I go. All right, we're all going. Let's do something here. We got to do something. Got a nice little line going here. Should I try the middle? There's a bit of a gap up here. Oh, Timmy wants up there now, too. What are you doing? Timmy's going to wreck himself. What are you doing? Clear right. Oh, Timmy. You need the fairly odd parents for that one, my friend. Bad times to be had. Still there. See if we can sneak underneath the Benedetto here. Are we going to launch our way into the top five here and be peeking at the podium? Oh, the Benedetto give me a little look there. And then Reagan says, don't mind if you just take the spot from me. No big deal. All clear. No and I couldn't agree behind. more. And I'm sorry, Jones, but I don't really want to push somebody into the bottom of the next corner. So I think I'm going to sneak underneath you if I can. And we Careful. do exactly that. And now we've got the double zero to worry about. Of course, the one car that's right been bothering me all race happens to be leading. Well, Quinn, you've got a lot of decisions to make, my friend, and you're running out of time to make them, and you're just going to give me a wide-open look at the Still bottom? There. What are you, nuts? He is. I gave him just a small push to the top side, and we're going to get side-by-side side and left. get a nose out. Can I shove him up even more? Oh, I can't leave the bottom open right, too much. And, of course, it's Joey Gase behind me that has to give me the push as we smack with the double zero. And Joey and I just about crashed Five each other. Now, there's not just about. We did crash each other earlier. Your and now we got to work together again. It doesn't get much more perfect than that. Careful, still there. Oh, Nobody quit touching that. that apron, dummy. I got to stop that. If I'm going to win, I, you got to just keep your momentum up. I got to keep pushing for that bottom Careful, like we there. just did. Side draft him all the way to the wall if I have to. I think the higher entry he has to take, the better I get on the bottom. Oh, and then I put it Careful, on the friggin' oh, yeah. apron like a bum. Oh, I'm so sick of that. I got to quit doing that. But here comes the push from Gase. He might be Careful, my savior oh, right yeah. here. He might push me to lead this lap. And he does. Yes. Thank you, Joey Gase. Still there. Now we're side by side for the lead at Daytona with Starcom Racing on the outside. And I guess the independent Soundhead Motorsports on the inside. And finally, we make the clearing. We take the lead. Power and then the immediately the caution comes out. This is a joke. Green flag flies once again here at Daytona, hopefully for the final time, because as we cross this line, line NASCAR overtime outside. has begun at Daytona. It's going to be a green-white checker. And I think this late race restart with us in the lead plays out massively to our advantage because it takes them a little bit of time to get up to speed. So that means they can't do a lot on this first lap here. And we're coming to the white flag, which means I might only have to do some blocking of a serious kind for about one lap. White flag's in the air. One, more to go. one lap to go. They are too wide behind us, so we got to look in that mirror. I conveniently didn't map a look back button. 
So I've got to do the mirror driving the old-fashioned way and look up and keep it in between the two lanes if I can. I've got the legends behind me of Bobby Carter and Joey Gase. This is shaping up to be one hell of a podium at Daytona. But we might do it if we can just hold it right here. They just cannot get the run. Oh, Almirola's looking for three wide. That could be a problem. And then Joey Gase slams the door on him. Coming out of four. I think Joey Gase is the MVP of this race. He may have put us in the wall one time, but that was not exclusively his fault. He takes one last shot, but no dice. Look we get, get the yours. dub at Daytona. You love to see it, ladies and gentlemen. That one is for Fanatic and all of you. Is it even a question if we're going to do a burnout? Are you kidding me? We're becoming a regular at burning that down at Daytona. We seem to have these Daytona races on a lock nowadays. We are something to be feared. We got to burn it down right here, Dale style, on the graphics in the grass. You have to do it and celebrate this win. It was a good win. From the back to the front, then back to the mid pack after the incident with Joey Gates and a bunch of other incidents along the way. Ran into a bunch of different cars today. The field's probably all ready to beat me up as usual with these things, but you know what? That just means we had another successful day at the race. So we're scouring through the uh, replay system here to see all the different cautions. Of course, here was us with Joey Gates on lap 20. And then that last caution, as you see here, was for our man, Chase Elliott, losing it in the corner. And that is that first place 105 speed rating. We'll look at the results of this one and you can see where your favorite driver finished. Oh, tough break for Ross Chastain. He must've been one of the cars that blew an engine or something. He was one of the stories of the race for being so well prepared. And Eric Almirola did squeak by Bobby Carter for that last podium spot. You do kind of hate to see it, let's be honest, but it is what it is. It's a long season. And Bobby Carter sitting fourth in points overall. I doubt he's complaining right now. And that will bring us to victory lane where we get the giant Coca-Cola bottle trophy. The confetti and the fireworks are going nuts. And we're taking this trophy back to the shop, back to the house. We're running home with it all night. And with that, we are back at the shop. And at long last, the first half of our Daytona double is in the books and our season has begun. So I'm thinking this is going to be a pretty fun one, guys. This schedule is pretty cool. I think it gives a lot of chances for some smaller teams and names to put some points on the board. And that could keep things interesting. So this seems like a fun series. It's something we're going to keep going. And it's something that we are going to continue here again soon. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe for more. And with that, I'll see you in the next one. Boom!